What's up, guys? This here is Nico Myers. Uh, as you can see, I am, in fact, repping, ki repping King Piccolo. And uh, as you guys can hear in the background, uh, I have two very special guests for today's segment. Uh, we have on the right, or your, your, my left, your right, uh, the legendary Bono. And uh, this one here with the Dungeons & Dragons t-shirt is, in fact, Comzy. So, guys. It's a dragon. <laughs> At least it's a dragon, yes. We have all come prepared in some odd way, shape, and form for our topic today. And what is our topic today, gentlemen? Basically, stuff the characters could have done better in the show, really. Like, more specifically, Dr. Drow. Yeah. Um, in, and just warn you, this will involve some GT stuff, so... Well, it will mostly be GT yeah. stuff. Let me just move this over just a little bit to ensure we're all in there. There we so, go. Basically, That's probably a little bit better. If you're going to watch this, please watch... Have watched everything. Yeah, um, this is going to be a very different type of our discussion mm -hmm. because what I had mentioned earlier today was the character Cell, my favorite villain, obviously. Mm -hmm. um, they did him wrong. They did yeah. him in a great injustice, I believe. Mm -hmm. And here's why. The glasses come off when I'm serious, folks. <laughs> um, if you think about it, right after the Frieza saga, there was the androids and then there was Cell... Mm -hmm. If you think about it, if, if they had ended the Z series altogether with Cell, it would have been so much better. Because then he would also have the cells of Majin Buu, Kid Buu, Super Buu, what have you. Basically, um, if not if they ended at the Cell Saga, if the Cell Saga was after the Buu Saga. Uh, yeah, if Cell was after... If they moved the entire saga, basically. Yeah, and they were able to switch things around. Because not only that, if you think about it, there could have been some potential fusions in there then as well if you were just to pick up and drop it after Boo, because when you, when you look at it technically speaking, um, during a fusion, there's no longer two beings, it is just one ultimate being mm -hmm. created by two different characters. So, such as Gotenks. Mm -hmm. You take Gohan, or Goten. Goten and Trunks to make Gotenks, Gotenks will now have his own specific cells, mm -hmm. which is pretty much the better cells from both uh, characters to make one perfect being that mm -hmm. they could become. Yeah. So, that so you have Trunks and Gotenks stuff, you... You would have, have Trunks, yeah, uh, or Gotenks' stuff yeah. alongside Gohan you, and Trunks' uh, yeah. DNA. And you also have Gogeta. You have Gogeta. And, uh, Vegito. Yeah, you'd have Vegito. Um, so you'd have it along with Goku and Vegeta's. But that also being said, if you were to have just in. cut and paste <laughs> the uh, Cell Saga, mm -hmm. you would also have Ultimate Gohan at that point. If, they, if it was yeah. to somehow Mr. follow, Gohan, yeah. Be, basically. yeah, and then you would even see even how much more powerful mm -hmm. Cell would really be. Because if you remember, Gohan after he becomes Mystic was told that if you were to go Super Saiyan after becoming Mystic, you would yeah. destroy everything. Mm -hmm. So that's just how much yeah. more powerful Cell would have yeah. been if he had that Mystic DNA exactly. and all Plus these different have, Super Saiyan. Have DNA. Majin Buu, Super Buu, Kid, all the forms of Buu basically. So he would have a limitless key pool. Yeah. And, and impossible shape shifting abilities. Impossible, and also, well, he already can absorb other people, but yeah. he would do it in a different manner. Yeah, to where it wasn't just he stole their power, but then yeah. he just stole their body as yeah. well, and they're just no longer there in existence. Mm -hmm. Yeah, basically, you would be able to like what we did for most of the series, get blown into smithereens and just and then, form right back. Yeah. Oh, well, admittedly, I think Cell did do that what once or twice, well, once. Got, but he, that's he, because he, some he, of his cells survived. Well, he regenerated, he, so yeah, that was a uh, piccolo. As long as his yeah. nucleus, nucleus yeah. remains, he could... It would just re... re grow, re regrow. Mm -hmm. But he wouldn't have to regrow if he had Buddha cells, because he'd just he form right regenerate. back together. So even if they did technically blow him in the smithereens, as long as his nucleus stays, he could always come back, no matter what. But see, now all this being said, let's skip ahead. How many years was it into GT? Like, I think they said it was like another seven years until GT or something like that. Uh, well, so, okay, in... At the end of Z, I think Pan was like four. Yeah. And I think they said she was 12 in GT. So, so four, five, no, six, seven, eight, eight, nine, she ten, ten eleven. So either way, about six, 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 six to eight years. Yeah. Yeah. I'll say six yeah. to eight years is a good even number. Um, so let's say so. if they did somehow beat Cell at the end of all that, and now he's in hell, Dr. Jero is in hell, Every everybody that they've beaten yeah. is in hell. Baby comes around, mm -hmm. they beat Baby. Now we're at the Super 17 arc. So why would Dr. Zero use 17 to create a Super 17 and not Instead, Cell? Yeah, to make a even more perfect 
perfect cell. It, it would be, it would be way more beyond perfect. Yeah, mm-hmm. because if there would be a cell on Earth, mm-hmm. and then there would be a cell on or in Hell, there would be technically be two cells in Hell, mm-hmm. because like we were saying before. Um, that cell would have been so powerful, they're not going to try to take his body off him. He would just go yeah. Super Saiyan and destroy everything. Mm-hmm. Um, but that being said, if Jiro was to say to Cell, hey, listen, let me borrow your DNA so I, I can make a new version of you and make the two f- f- uh, make the two of you fuse, and then you could really destroy some shit, I'm pretty sure he'd be all up for it. Honestly, that would be if Cell agreed to it. But you I'm know pretty sure he yeah. would, though. I mean, he's this is a character that's all about perfection. Yeah. And if he so can be involved... If he can't becoming, achieve the perfection, at least... He would be it, involved in the perfection, yeah. and that's what his ultimate thing is. What's your take on this so far? Because you haven't said much like we have. Uh, I don't know. Because <laughs> I'm trying to think of something good to say about it, but most of the stuff you're saying is about what I think, too. So... So why not go and create a beyond perfect cell, if you will? Mm-hmm. Now the design—I don't even know what you would even do to the design at that yeah. point. I mean, yeah, we also did before this video have a very, very vigorous conversation about yeah. if the people in, in hell, hell even have cells, or if they're in it. But it's because there, there is a very good way to explain that they do. Yeah, basically, it's... we were trying to argue that they didn't. Yeah, and, and he kind of convinced us, like. Vegeta and Goku to fuse, there would have to be some kind of technical, physical DNA yeah. for them to become For them to become one, one. or else they'd probably just still be Goku. And... So even though they are dead, they still have their physical body. That would make them metaphysical. In order to become something metaphysical, you must have some sort of DNA in your metaphysical body. Yeah. And they, there has to be something like a blood like, or organ, something like that to make some... And even though, even if we don't go on that premises... Goku was still alive when he fought all these people in hell, mm-hmm. and he physically fought them. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Physically, it wasn't mentally, it wasn't just key blast. He went and straight up punched them in the face, and they actually reacted. Yeah. As if they were punched in the face. Think about it, that would actually... Another thing for the whole more than, more than perfect cell thing, they had become even stronger while they were in hell. Oh, yeah. yeah. So that would just be even that much more to... And that's even that's even saying that Cell happened before Boo. Yeah. And then there would have to be a way for them to actually get Majin Boo's DNA, uh, which, like I said before about the metaphysical aspect, um, I'm pretty sure that would even go along for the little uh, spirit balls, whatever whatever they were called. They, um, their soul thing. Their soul, whatever. whatever. Yeah. I and I myself think that there must be some kind of metaphysical thing to that as well, because they still seem to carry out their personality traits. Uh, and even just their actual own voices and whatnot. So there must be some kind of way to extract a DNA from that in the world of Dragon Ball Z. And with how smart jo- Dr. Zero really is, I mean, he's an idiot, but he's also a genius, too. It's... Yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> I mean, you've got to learn from something. Yeah. yeah it's... From him before being like, you know, oh, we have all your data, and then like two seconds later, the hell's a super saiyan. Yeah, yeah. I'm assuming he'd be like, yeah, no, we need to do a lot longer. Plus, here's another thing. If it took place out, he'd have their super saiyan DNA. Yeah. Well, and then well, although like, I don't know if their DNA well, actually changes when they're super saiyan. Well, no, I mean, Cell no. had super saiyan DNA. Well, you think of it this way, though, too. If, if, Yeah, if, but if. the DNA Cell had, they hadn't been super saiyan yet that when he had the DNA. No, it well, no, but so if he learned how to... Yeah, yeah. yeah learned how to true, yeah, that. yeah, because he had... Trunks is but now that saying, being yeah. said, though, as well, um, after everybody is dead and they'd all be in hell, you mean to tell me that Jero isn't watching from hell during the Boo saga I mean, yeah, and sees yeah, Super Saiyan 3? Yeah. yeah. Now, at the time of Cell, there was no Super Saiyan 3. They only went up to Super Saiyan 2. Mm-hmm. So explain to me how is it that Cell couldn't go Super Saiyan 3 during his series. Yeah. Because it was a potential that was not known, so Jero could not program him mm-hmm. to go even further. But he knows it now. But now in that, but then also we plus know if we're go- we're if we're including GT in this, there's Super Saiyan Four. Well, as well. I was going to say, Jiro would have, would have seen been... Super Saiyan Four yeah. against, with Goku's fight against Baby. Mm-hmm. Which that also being said, he would have some. He must and have, he have baby DNA too. Mm-hmm. So we're once again that's still the same process so, that Cell could be a, could have been a better candidate than Seventeen. Think about if he had baby DNA, that means he can take over the entire civilization and mm-hmm. get energy from all of them. And if he didn't want to do that, he wouldn't have to. Mm-hmm. Because he could just keep absorbing everybody the same See, way. See, this is a much better plan than just, let's just make another 17. Yeah. 
Because that's basically what it was. Let's just make another 17 so that will combine and be as strong as two 17s. Yeah, this way at least. And then <laughs> I mean, if they were to fuse the two different the cells was not together. Too bad. No, I mean, but, but still. Well, and then if you out, take so. the two different cells and fuse them together, mm-hmm. boom. I mean, yeah, Plus, you wouldn't these... have to worry about um, 18 getting into 17's head to convince him not to. Because who's going to convince the ultimate life form? Yeah. So, yeah. He thinks. You so you don't have to worry about the good 17, like, Whatever. personality it's taking over. Because there is no cells. good cell. Yeah. No. It's just cell. All right, guys. Well, I think I just proved my point, and I believe <laughs> that they all have also uh, been convinced by my point, and they also agree with me. Yeah, also, I didn't nice. talk too much because most of it I kind of nice. agree with. So. All right, guys. So tell me in the comment section if what you guys think of this whole discussion. Uh, make sure you rate the video, and don't forget to subscribe. Plus, any points you have, good or negative, about our ideas, put them in there. Even try to disprove them if we like them. Disprove it. Yeah. I dare you. Try to disprove it. Later, guys. <laughs>